Newton Square man who was attacked with a firebomb when he refused to worship with neighbors at a local synagogue is yet the victim of another run-in with arson. Ramapo police say Aaron Rottenberg's car was set on fire last night. News 12's John Goff has more for us. At the beginning, I had nightmares in the hospital. I couldn't sleep. I would wake up like I'm still at the scene. I would shake. That's how Aaron Rottenberg described the terror he felt while recovering from a firebombing last year. Rottenberg had been in a dispute with other members of the New Square Hasidic community over where he would worship. And then, this Thursday night, someone set fire to his car outside his mother's house in New Square. But according to Ramapo police, Rottenberg says the two incidents are not connected. He believes this has to do with a dispute he had with somebody he was counseling and they came to a disagreement and subsequent to that, pretty much immediately following after that, uh, when the person left, uh, he observed that his car, the back of his car, uh, was on fire. The man who set Rottenberg on fire last May, Scholl Spitzer, pled guilty to charges in that case last month. The car was parked here in this driveway and police say the fire was started under the rear end of the vehicle. It wasn't totally engulfed in flames. Uh, it was actually blown out by, by the wind. It was very windy last night, uh, but there was some you know, damage to the paint. Rottenberg was not at home when we stopped by his house to talk with him, but he reportedly wants to press charges in this latest case of arson. In New Square, John Goff, News 12. And police tell News 12 tonight that whoever set fire to Aaron Rottenberg's car will now most likely be charged with third-degree arson.